Got in from shoveling the ramp off. Uh, help my grandson do it with the dishes, load the dishwasher, or empty it. He loaded it. So, yeah. So, been quite the morning, quite the afternoon. For some reason, I woke up late, but I did manage to. Uh, I did manage to go out and get uh, or get on the phone and uh, straighten out my my money is for my old age security and stuff. So that's done. I just have to mail it. Uh, yeah, I have an appointment tomorrow, and uh, it just so happens that my grandson had a hockey tournament. He didn't know about it to the last minute. I guess. They called them up and so yeah, but it's at three, three, three fifteen or three ten, and my appointment's at three twenty. So I had to make other arrangements, and that's fine. You know, my daughter said she could have done it anyways, but uh, would have been a little bit stressful for her. Anyway, so I called my friend, uh, my friend Brent, and uh, or Brent. I don't want to get them mixed up with the other one, but uh, my friend Brent. And uh, he plans on he he was planning on going to uh, uh, Cabela's, <laughs> so he said, "Oh, I'll drive you." So we'll go to Cabela's first, and then we'll come back. We'll uh, get your driving test, and then we'll uh, head it back home. And I said, "Sure, sounds good." So yeah, I've had a few things I've had to deal with and do, and uh, one of them look at myself, I guess, because uh, well, it's not I guess I I did have to look at myself. I had some. Uh, some people gent gently give me a nudge, which is fine. And, uh, you know, and I've had to, uh, yeah, I've had to reevaluate stuff. I've let myself go and, uh, and it's like, you know, I've fallen and I can't get up type of scenario. But I mean, I can, I just gotta do better. Uh, and it's just overwhelming because I gotta do better and then I gotta, this has to be done, that has to be done. and. It's very confusing and frustrating, and I gotta line it all up and uh, just do one thing at a time. That's all I can do, one thing at a time. So I woke up this morning, it was the first thing, and then got on the phone, did a few things, take my medicine, eat eat my breakfast at like 1.30. Uh, my sugars were all right, but I mean, for me it was nine. And that's what the doctor so like said. Anything, you know, if you can get it down to nine, that's good in my situation. So I try to, uh, you know, I try not to eat. Uh, I'm trying not to. I mean, it's only the first day, so I'm not going to kill myself or I'm not going to beat myself up for it. But I am aware of it. Got to eat more vegetables. I thought I had some in the fridge, but they've gone bad. So, uh, so I have to get some more. So I just, whatever was left open already I sort of like ate that I threw in some mushrooms and I uh, had uh, I had two eggs uh, real eggs and uh, that was it so uh, I didn't I don't think I ate a lot a lot but I mean I, I had a plate and then that was it so I haven't had nothing else and I have to go to the, I guess I'll have to go to the store make arrangements try to figure how I can do things and uh, yeah, I gotta buy a few other things like uh, vegetables and stuff, salads and stuff. But I know I have to change my diet, so I know that. I, you know, I haven't drank pop really. I haven't brought any home with me for like, I think maybe over a month, maybe more. Uh, I have had pop when I went to the. I have had had pop when I went to the uh, out for lunch or something. Uh, but yeah, normally I haven't been drinking it at home. Drinking a lot, a lot of that uh, mix there, that uh, non-sugar mix. Colors, colors my water. I have a hard time just drinking plain water like that. It messes up my throat. 
Maybe that's just me, but it, it just it just does. And I know you can throw in them and you can do different things, and I'm aware of that. But for now, it's baby steps, but I gotta move because I can do better and I have to do better, so, you know. Yeah, it's just a little bit of, uh, you know, I'm just pissed off at myself, I guess. I can't get too pissed off, but I'm pissed off at myself. I have to, uh, you know, it's my life. I gotta figure it out and do what I can do. Every now and then you need a good shaking up. I guess this was mine. I'm not saying it's gonna take, but I mean, I'm aware of it, so I gotta do something about it. So yeah. Uh, I mean, obviously diet's important. Just because I'm not eating like junk food or whatever, you know, candy or bags of chips or anything like that. Just because I'm not eating that doesn't mean I'm eating right. I'm not eating enough vegetables, I know that. Uh, I've been told, so yeah. So I gotta rearrange it. And I've always had a hard time with that. It just seems like everything is like, oh, like, you know, coming at me at once, but it's really not. It's not, I don't think it's coming at me at once. I think it's because I put it off for a while and for a long time. And it's just like, yeah, sometimes to be stubborn is a good thing. Sometimes to be so stubborn is uh, harmful for your health. Cause yeah, uh, and you know, I'd rather have people tell me that stuff straight up, but you know, some of them feel that they have to be a little softer on approach. Which is fine too, but you know, it's just like, you know, just spit out what you gotta say. So they did, and uh, either verbally, like talk to talk or text to text, but they did. And uh, they, people have been saying it for a long time, so I have to sort of like address it now. Because, yeah, I'm not, I'm not really feeling up to par. I'm sleeping a lot. Like, like I said, I woke up this morning, I woke up at 11.20. You know, and that's from last night. That's like I went to bed at like two-ish, and I slept all that time. I got up once to go to the washroom. So yeah. And uh, I mean, I made some. I made a call this morning to the nurse, asked her a question about the new medication. I haven't started it yet because I wasn't really sure. You know, but uh, yeah, I don't know if I'm. They give me the med the side effects of that medication is. Uh, nausea and you could lose some weight well losing the weight be a great thing but i'm not sure if i want to go through the nausea stuff too much anyways uh yeah and you gotta skin pop it so i wasn't really sure i, I know what skin pop means but i wasn't really sure what that thoroughly meant so yeah so i gotta figure that out too but uh right now you know I figured, uh, what the heck, I mean, I ate breakfast, like I said, brunch, I guess, I ate that, then I went out and I shoveled, uh, it's not a lot, but I shoveled uh, the pathway to get out of the house, I made arrangements for tomorrow, uh, and uh, yeah, I mean, I could only do, and I called, uh, called the Canada service, service Canada or whatever, for my, for my checks. I did get partially payment, but I don't know, you know, uh, and it'll, it'll take a while, but a par partial payment plus it'll take up to 100 to 200 days to figure it all out, I guess. So, uh, yeah, but it's retroactive, so I'm good on that. Uh, I just watched a few videos while I was waiting for phone calls and waiting. I was on hold for well over an hour. And I watched a few videos. I watched Chrome put his, uh, put in, got the beast together and taking it out for a run. And, you know, watched other people and uh, just looked at a few things, you know, and uh, trying to think and contemplate stuff all in the meantime. So, yeah, things have to change, anyways. We'll try to do it now. But, uh, yeah, I'll try to do it now. Anyways, other than that, things are okay. Everything's on the up and up.
and uh, yeah, trying to figure out where the heck I go from here, you know. Uh, but I do know a lot of people out there who care about me, and uh, you know, I guess I've uh, gotten into their lives if they wanted it or not. But uh, yeah, you know, that's a good thing. I just got to recognize that, you know. Anyways, on that note, yeah, it's not really a it's not really a joyous video, but uh, I guess it's a little bit sadder. You know, sometimes when you got to look at yourself, you're not all too happy about it. <laughs> okay, peace. I love you. Or aloha. I love you. Sorry, my hands aren't working too well either. So, <laughs> till next time. Take care. Bye.